Brothers and sisters in Yeshua Christ, Shalom. Brothers and sisters, let us pray. Father Almighty, your name, Jehovah, Holy Spirit, Yeshua. Your name alone, all the glory to you. This time, especially as your request, Heavenly Father, as your request, I strongly pray to you, please be with me, Father Almighty. This message, especially this message today, your son and daughter, save them from the evil spirit. Every single individual, your sons and daughters, chosen one, covered with the blood of Yeshua. Let them know the truth out there and let them prepare truly, truly to be raptured. Father Almighty, please be with me. This really moment, I really need you. Fathers, please be with me. In the name of Yeshua, I pray. Amen. Brothers and sisters, all of the world, Shalom. Today, I would like to talk about there is a power in the name of Yeshua. And God Almighty spoke to me. Heavenly Fathers, it sometimes, whenever He wants to speak to me, anytime, any kind of the ways He spoke to me, sometimes whispering me, or sometimes through the, my dream and visions, He spoke to me. But that night, especially November 3, 2014, Monday, that night before November 3, 2014, Monday, especially before I wake up, before we wake up, Almighty God spoke to me very strongly. And it was really intense. Whenever Heavenly Father should show me the vision and dream, Sometimes I received so many dreams and visions from the evil spirit as well. I strongly, I have to distinguish here and there, over 13 years here and there, like a small little puzzle. Try to put it together and try to the message out for the God Almighty, His chosen one, His son and daughter. It is not really easy for me at all. But brothers and sisters all over the world, I strongly these videos, I would like to talk about the evil demon spirit. They are surrounding us. They are all the times bugging us, especially chosen one. Brothers and sisters all over the world, I want you to know and God wants you to be aware about the, who they are and how can you manage about them brothers and sisters all over the world i had uh, so many demons attacking experience lately especially recently almost a daily basis they are set me up brothers and sisters all over the world i would like to let you know and god almighty already knows about it November 3, 2014, it was very intense, short message God Almighty spoke to me. God Almighty, Jehovah, Holy Spirit, especially Jehovah, Ava Father, when He spoke to me, He is different compared to Yeshua Christ, the boys. As you're your children of God, you can distinguish which one is our Father's voice and which one is Yeshua Christ's voice. If you're really true son and daughter of God. So that day, God Almighty spoke to me, November 3, 2014. He spoke to me. The, survey, the salvation is only belong to Yeshua. The salvations only belong to Yeshua. So many dirty, evil spirits interrupting, interrupting us, which is His Son, 
God Almighty, sons and daughters, so many dirty, filthy spirits interrupting us, bogging us, attacking us, attacking us. So he spoke to me strongly in the name of Yeshua, rebuke them. This is a very important message. Sons and daughters of God, true bride of Yeshua, brothers and sisters all over the world. None of the God is existence. True God, God of Israel, God of Moses, God of Abraham. That is God, Jehovah is the only the God. And Yeshua is only the God, Lord of Lord, King of King, Arpa and Omega. So in that day, it was really intense. He spoke to me, God Almighty, November 3, 2014. Almighty Abba Father spoke to me. The salvations only belong to Yeshua. So many dirty, filthy demon spirit attacking us. So rebuke them in the name of Yeshua. That was God Almighty spoke to me. Brothers and sisters all over the world, I would like to talk about today is about the evil demon spirit. I had a lot of experience, but according to my experience, I just want you to know and I want you to be aware about who they are. And in the name of Yeshua, rebuke them. Mark, Mark chapter 5. Mark chapter 5, that is verse 7 to 8. He shouted at the top of his voice, What do you want with me? Yeshua, son of the most high God, swear to God that you won't torture me. For Yeshua had said to him, Come out of this man, you evil spirit. Yeshua Christ, he is real God. So, even Mark, I would like to show you even Mark chapter 3, that is verse 11 to 12. Whenever the evil spirit had to saw him, they fell down before him and cried out, You are son of God. But he gave them the strict orders not to tell who he was. Brothers and sisters all over the world, all over the world this video I would like to introduce about the, you know, demon spirit. They are really existence, especially non-christian or they don't know about the Yeshua christ or they don't care about the god almighty they do not they do not really showing up in their dream but especially chosen one especially christian if you are truly truly repent and go back to the Yeshua christ the god almighty and try to read the bible again try to you know pray again in the name of yeshua they are start bugging you According to my experience, they just like bugging me some point of time so that was ghost level, but day by day, my, my soul and my faith is stronger and they send it to me more evil and the more stronger they send it to me. So I would like to introduce a couple of the just my dream, not everything because there are so many evil spirit experience but now I know and then I know how can I how can I take care about myself because in the dreams I can distinguish and in the dreams I can pray and in the dreams I can pray in tongue as well so it is January 28 2016 it was Thursday 6 a.m. to 8 20 I had a dream so it was kind of the my old my mom's house and I just like skipped, it is not necessary story, but I was laid down in my bed in my dream and there was demon spirit, it was surrounding me. There was two males and there was two females. And whenever the demon attacking, they are not really, your feeling, my feeling was it is filthy and dirty and disgusting and it is chaos. It is so noisy and it is not really peace and love and doesn't have that kind of things at all. It is really filthy and disgusting. It is very confused and very chaos. 
So I I already right right away I I know they are surrounding me four demons surrounding me and then right away I was like a start start to rebuke them in the name of Yeshua and I just hold demons face I hold the demons face with the two hands and then right away I was shut it out in the name of Yeshua Yeshua is God Almighty he is the son of God go away and then he was, he was, he seems, he, he seems, he tried pretending he is not demon. And then I just like, again, in the name of Yeshua, Yeshua Christ is King of King, Lord of Lord, Arpa and Omega, in the name of Yeshua, in the name of Yeshua, go away. And then he couldn't handle in the name of Yeshua because there is a power in the name of Yeshua. He was he, he was started that demon I targeted. He was started shaking his body. And then finally, I was keep going like I I speak in tongue. I was in a praying tongue, and the Lord of Lord. I just keep going until he is disappear. King of King, Lord of Lord, Son of God. In the name of Yeshua, in the name of Yeshua, go away. And then finally, he spoke to me. That was the first ever time demon spirit was spoke to me, and then he spoke to me like this. How do you know? So, which meaning is a lot of people so they're interrupting, they're attacking them, you know, through the dream and set them up, but they do not know. They was terrifying. They was like running away. But that meaning is, how am I know them? So that was really intense for me in that dream. And wow, they started to spoke to me now. So it was in that dream, in that dreams what I learn, what I learn. I can rebuke them in the dreams in the name of Yeshua. I can control a little bit better myself in the dream. And I could speak in tongue in the dream. And they speak to me. They spoke to me. That was, it was interesting dream. And then I would like to just like show just a couple of dreams. Especially this one was... After I saw the, that was November 3, 2016, I saw the vision of, it is, we're going to have, wedding ceremony is already ready to go. We're going to go to the wedding ceremony, Rosh Hashanah, Messiah's wedding is coming, and then we have to prepare ourselves. That day, next day, November 4, 2016, Friday, 7.20 a.m. to the 9.25 a.m., it was a dream. That was extreme demon experience as well. I my soul was going, go, my soul was going down, and then it was it was it was seems like it was seems like um you know like a basement the first basement to basement three seems like I was going down, and then there was there was a um next windows one of the demon looks male demons he was waiting for me and is sitting down and he was staring at me and then i was right away right away i was uh, um recognized he was demon because my soul was going down and the demons and then i said demon what are you doing here and then he spoke to me management he spoke to me. They start to spoke to me nowadays, the demon spirit. So management. And since then, I was physically fight with him, like kind of crazy, crazy physically fight with him. And after then, then what I learned from this dream, you know, I was a little bit, my uh, spiritual level was more on guard, more, more, you know, listening the gospel music. We really set years, um, reading the bible more pray more and then to put it in the uh, cross in my in my room as well so brothers and sisters it is a short period of time so i try to um explain about the, who they are in the name of yes there is a name yeshua's name there is a power in it brothers and sisters um i try to make this video because Yeshua Christ is coming very soon. We do not have a lot of time left, but daily basis, they're attacking us as much as they can and wake up and always, always pray and be prepared yourself and always pray and always, always read the Bibles in the name of Yeshua. Shalom.